hi guys welcome to my channel and how to download gigabyte motherboard driver so first you have to come this site www.gigabyte.com this officially website so you can download the driver after that right hand side this is search icon just click on it and then enter the model number of your motherboard b50 aeros elite wi-fi 7 and then hit enter to search on this websites for driver then click on the product and this is your motherboard just click on it then click on support then select your operating system windows 10 11 so the both operating system installations process same so first guys download after that i show you installations audio driver sd audio driver and click to download when you click to download it will start downloading in the download box here okay after that chipset chipset so amd chipset driver and click to download LAN driver, Realtek LAN driver and click to download Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and Wi-Fi so download one by one after that click on this icons where it is downloaded it will open then show you how to install so this is your driver so wait for complete so guys it is completed so first download all driver first select this and right click and extract all and same locations just extract it okay it will open and close it okay this created this folder you can see then info update right click extract all extract and same close it you can then this one right click and extract all one by one do that then this right click extract all and then extract so one by one extract all or your driver otherwise you can without extract and you just double click to install but sometime we get the issues in this last then it is done and close it then just right click to refresh it so this is your actual driver and this is also your but this is extracted so guys first open this select right click and run as administrator then click on yes
so wait few seconds is installing it will take some time okay it will close automatically means this is install it okay it is closed automatically means this is installed then go to back then second one same select and right click to administrator run as administrator and then yes So it is closed automatically means this is installed. Go back, then third one. Just select and right click to run as administrator. Then click on yes. because the installation process is very simple so it is closed automatically means this is installed then fourth one open select right click to run as the administrator then click on yes So it is closed automatically means install and then come to back again. Then fifth one. Same select and right click to run as administrator. Then click on yes. So it is closed automatically means this is installed then back then second last this one and this is last so open this select right click to run as administrator after that click on yes So it is closed means this is installed back and last one graphic driver just open it and the same select and right click to run as administrator
then click on yes So this is installing driver, this is graphic card driver, display driver, monitor driver, you can say that. So it will set them, take, take some time after install the all driver then restart your system. Okay, restart so important for your system after install the driver. Okay, thank you.